see Charlie. We're out here at Valley Village. We've never, we've never done this before. We're gonna go try thrifting. So come along on the adventure. Mm -hmm. See, like this is not bad at all, and it's like $7.49. Why do I sort of like this? <laughs> that was an interesting experience. Um, verdict? I'm not a thrifter. I'm just not. Um, I did buy one of those shirts though. Um, I have a vision for it and it was five dollars <laughs> so even if I wear it once for half a day even <laughs> like it's fine but yeah not not my thing definitely definitely not my thing so I'm just at work it's uh <laughs> Hi. this is Anna do you, Amy do you want to be in there well there's <laughs> this is her her mom's over there yeah mom is over here and we're just and chilling. she's drinking coffee or whatever. water, water. Yeah. oh my god <laughs> I'm in Tom Bargain right now and um they're playing Raylan Baxter <laughs> Jake Gyllenhaal you got some competition it's Wednesday, July 24th, and we're heading out to go for a walk. A little evening Wednesday walk. The Wednesday evening walk. Because I have been just so un... Is unmotivated a word? I have just been so unmotivated recently, and um, it could possibly be because there's just too much time at home. I don't know what it is, because what we've been doing is we've been... My neighbor's outside. One second. Let me in. Because we don't really do much in the evenings and we kind of like just sit and do nothing. So maybe it's time to break that cycle and uh, start doing stuff in the evening. So we're going for a walk. And I forgot that the whole point of this clip was to show you my outfit, but um, I forgot to do that. stationary <laughs> um, and then this top it's like a button-up it's super cute it's from a brand called Oak and Fort um, and I love their stuff and that's it Come on. fun walk. Um, it's outside in nature. It's now 8 o'clock and usually around this time I'd be going to my room to get ready for bed. Um, so I'm proud of us for being out. Um, like mom said on the way here, I mean isn't this better than just sitting at home waiting for bed? <laughs> and yeah, I have to say it is better than just sitting at home waiting for bed. Hello, it's Thursday, July 25th and I'm back at it again with the online orders. Um, so first up, oh, Charlie, hi. Do you wanna be a part of this? So first up, we have <laughs> we have um, an order from a jury, which is a <clears throat> jewelry place. Nicely wrapped. Is this lighting really bad? Yeah, kind of. No, maybe, I, maybe it's just that I look like shit, you know, and I'm always blaming the lighting. Maybe it's just me. Don't you fly away. Okay, so I got I got two things. Um, I got this beautiful necklace. I don't know why I just said it like that. Um, it's the, how do you say it? Gardenia? 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 It's the 
gardenia medallion and I think it's so pretty. I'm gonna wear it with this one. And then I also got a pair of earrings which are very different for me because I just like have these in day and night. I literally sleep with them in because they're so small and like I can't feel them and I just like it has been really nice wearing these because it's like no fuss and I don't have to worry about like forgetting to put them in and they're just like in my ear all the time. Um, but I'm gonna try something different. These are so pretty. They're just like gold hoops. And then I got a couple of things from, you guessed it, Aritzia. Don't you fly away, Char. Oh. Okay, maybe we should change angles again. Yeah. So the theme of this haul is very, um, it's silky items, you know? Item number one, uh, a beautiful camisole. And it's actually the same one that I'm wearing right now, um, but silky. And then, hi, sorry, um, another uh, angle change here. And then also this really cute little number, also silky, kind of cropped, kind of summery. And then, oh, right, I got this like, um, oops. Got this like black slip dress. Here's this one. This one, um, yeah, it's nice. It's really nice. Like I said, it's like the the one that I'm wearing today, but silky. And uh, and yeah, I think it's I think it's really pretty. So here's this one. Um, it's cute. Uh, I just don't know if I love it. You know, actually, I'm not sure yet. I don't know. Actually, it's quite nice, right? It's quite pretty. I think, uh, like, just like take the big old fucking tie out of the way here. Yeah, I think I like it. Okay, and here's that dress. Um, weirdly enough, I hate it. Um, I have like the same dress, but like in a more like, um, it's like a denim kind of. But yeah, I, I really, I really don't like what's going on with this one. I look amazing today. Oh my god. You do. You look beautiful, Jenna. Like always. Look also, what Charlie did. She scratched my pimple. Are you okay? Mm. Ooh. Um, anyway, I got some new clothes yesterday. Rip. Um, so, <laughs> I yeah, I had a shopping spree at Aritzia. And these are two items that I got. This t-shirt and this dress. Okay, and so here's the new jewelry. Um, love him. I really do. He's so cute. I don't know why I'm referring to it as a he, but uh. And then the earrings, I actually quite like. Um, they're very different for me. What is going on with the lighting here? Um, but yeah, I think, I think I like them. So I just brought all my new stuff down to my room. I got changed into this. So cute, actually. Um, and I'm still wearing my new necklace. Um. I don't like this lighting for me. Um, one second. I'm not wearing the new earrings yet because that would just be a little bit too much new for right now. And also, um, you know how I am with change and I don't really like it. And I think the earrings are really nice, but I don't want to wear them yet. Uh, so yeah. I also just had, I almost, I also almost just had a little bit of a meltdown because um, after Folk Fest, my denim shorts were literally disgusting. I got home and they were f***ing damp because of how much I sweat that day because it was so f***ing hot. Um, and they were also just covered in maple syrup and other goodies. Um, so we had to wash them and then I threw them on today for the first time after watch washing them and I had thought we had shrunk them because they just weren't sitting on my body right and they weren't like rolling up right and these are like the only this is literally my only pair of denim shorts and like they're obviously they're like perfect and so I was so upset but they still might look a little bit small like but I think I got them like pretty close to how they were before um I, just gotta, I think I just gotta stretch them out again you know I mean, I bought them stretched out because I bought them from the, I bought them from like a thrift store and they were like humongous. Um, but yeah, I just gotta break them in. And like I said yesterday, we're trying to get out of the house more in the evening. So we've decided to go on yet another little walk this evening. Getting out of the car now. As you can see, I'm wearing the um, just perfect, appropriate 
uh, walking shoes. So here we go. Hi, we're already getting back into the car because out, I was getting eaten alive by mosquitoes and that's not a fun time. All right, so instead we had a nice stroll along the beach and now it's home time, time to go home. So it's Friday, July 26th, and I'm home for the weekend. I got to leave about 15 minutes early, which was so nice, because I actually got home quite earlier than I usually do. Um, and today is a extremely, I mean, exciting and sad day, because we're watching the last two episodes of Game of Thrones. Um, we haven't watched it all week so that we could save like the final two episodes for tonight. So we're having a Game of Thrones finale party. Um, just me and my mom. And yeah, I mean, am I ready for it to be over in a way? Am I still sad about it? 110, you know? Um, but yeah, um, my last package from Aritzia has come in. So I figured because I showed y'all all the other stuff, I'm gonna show y'all this one too. So here's this one, um, another silky piece. Um, I really love this one. I like the like the neckline, I think. I don't really have anything like that, so. So yeah, I love it. I should also address the obvious. Um, my hair is in a ponytail, which is so rare and so weird. Um, but actually, I don't mind it, because plot twist, I know I said yesterday, that I wasn't gonna start wearing these earrings right away because it was too much change and too much new for me. But I did start wearing them today and I actually don't even mind my hair back like this when I have these earrings in for some reason. I just, I just don't mind it. Um, and I also just had no choice but to wear my hair in a ponytail this afternoon because my hair is so nasty and greasy. Um, but yeah, I had no choice, so. There you have it. What are you doing? It's over. That's so crazy. When did we start this? May. 17. May? Yeah. Wow. So this has been like, we watch this every single night for like, I guess two months. That's crazy. And now it's over. Wow. You know what? I don't know what everyone was bitching about. I thought they did it good. Like I thought the ending was good. It was like perfectly bittersweet. And... Yeah, I don't have anything bad to say about it. I thought it was really good. I thought like even like the six episodes they did it. I think that was fine. So, um, I'm in my room now, as you can see, I'm gonna start winding down for the night. It's like 1030, um, but I, I mean, I feel like I haven't like had a good room sit down talk with y'all in like a while, so let's f***ing talk. Um, I know I mentioned in, I know I already, I know I already mentioned in this vlog that I've been feeling very unmotivated lately. I have just been so unmotivated recently. And I have, I've been feeling very unmotivated. Um, remember like those three books that I had bought at the beginning of summer so that I could read over the summer? We got Into the Wild on this. So I also got um, his John Krakauer's account of it. So I got this one too. Well, I've only gotten through one and a half of them, and it's been three months. Um, so it's like, even I find reading really hard to like, I don't know why, like it should be like a fun, like little like chill hobby, but I just, I can't force myself to do it. I mean, even like editing vlogs, like 
again, no motivation to do that. Some of you guys know that I like to write songs and I've been working and usually it takes me like two months to finish a song, but I've had a couple like started for the past, I'd say, yeah, like three months and I have, like I barely, and I barely work on them and like that's something I usually really enjoy and I just like, I, I'm just in such a like, I don't want to say, well, I guess I am in a slump. I kind of am in a slump. That being said, today I felt very out of that. I don't know what it, the energy of today was just very different. I didn't feel as unmotivated as I usually do. But yeah, I've been really struggling with that lately. I have like a hard time getting out of bed in the morning. Um, I haven't consistently exercised and I really don't know how long. Um, and if I do, I'll go for a week and then I won't do it again for another month. Like it's, it's been this awful cycle. And I think this is all just because like in my life, I'm usually like going through it. Like I said, that's very on brand for me. Then I was just going through it. You know, that was pretty, it's pretty on brand for me. Um, just been going through it. And then I like come out of that and I'm like, at peace and happy with my life and then something happens to then put me so that I am going through it again and so it's just very it's been very up and down the last like year and a half I guess um, and I'll be honest I went to see a therapist um, thought that maybe she could help me out um, and it turned out that that wasn't for me uh, it didn't actually I didn't find it very helpful um, and I actually left like the sessions feeling worse than I did before but actually that was helpful because um, because it like showed me that I was like I am willing to like help myself obviously and that wasn't a way to help myself like for me um, so then I could like move on to the next thing like trying to help myself um, and that's kind of where I'm at now with just trying to figure out like what to do now to get that motivation back. And I think a lot of it has to do with summer. Like summer is a really funny time for me. Um, I find that there's like a lot of pressure to always be doing something or like always be like out and like having plans. And like if I'm sitting at home watching Game of Thrones, like I feel, I don't know, like I just feel not good about it. And I think that sucks. And I think, yeah, like I said, I think summer is just a really funny time for me anyway um and i think back to school is gonna be really um good for for how i'm feeling um because i really really do well in like routine and even though yeah i get up and go to work every day uh during the summer it's not like the same routine as like school and then having to come home and study it's like um i think i i think i thrive when i'm really really busy and like right now i'm not really really busy and if i am busy with like plans and other things like i'm forcing myself to do it which is like sad and i and it's really too bad but like i said summer's always been a has been a really funny time for me and like i was watching some of my vlogs from the winter time when i was more so in a point where i was at peace again um and you can literally i feel like you can see the difference in me and the vlogs, like the vlogs were so, like, I just, I just found that I, f like, I, I seemed so, like, happy and, like, funny and, and I don't think I f seem like that anymore. Like, I, like, when I watch, like, the vlogs I've been posting recently, like, I just feel like they're so dull and, like, just, like, I'm not fully like myself, but that's, like, part of this process for me, like, of the whole ups and downs and, um, I'm just hoping that once I get up again, I stay there for a little while longer than usual. But yeah, I think I am going to end this vlog here. Um, we do have something fun planned for tomorrow, so that'll be in a different... That'll be the next vlog. I'm also really sorry that I looked like this throughout this whole clip. I'm just realizing now how awful... <laughs> how awful I look. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did... Remember to give this video a thumbs up for me and I will talk to you later.